We've been in business for more than 200 years and without our customers, there's no Centrica. And so we have to support our customers through thick and thin. It's the right thing to do. We've done that through the energy crisis. We've put 50 million pounds aside to help those customers of ours that need it most. The work that the British Gas Energy Trust does is incredible. It will give direct relief where people can't afford to pay their bills, but it also helps to fund other charities. What they try to do is not just fix today's issue, they try and fix the issue forever. Over the last 12 months, the British Gas Energy Trust has awarded just under five million to frontline energy and money services. These are 58 charities based in England, Scotland and Wales who are there in the heart of communities to help people who are struggling. We make sure that our funding goes to those charities in the areas where we feel there is the most need around fuel poverty. We also know that people are quite reticent of coming forward and it can be difficult to know where to go to seek help. So we've partnered with the post office who have trusted hubs within those communities so that when people come in, there's someone here from a local charity to help provide them with support and maybe open that door to a dialogue to start them on the journey to accessing the help they need. In addition to that, the Trust has also awarded over £12 million in debt write-off grants. These are grants of up to £1,500 to households who are struggling with energy debt. Just under 10,000 people have benefited from debt write-off grants in 2022. That is open to everyone, regardless of whether they're a British Gas customer or not. Hopefully enabling them to stay warm and dry for many years to come. It's really important that those companies who are able to help their customers do so. I feel very strongly about that. So the £50 million that we put aside, plus the commitment to donate 10% of the profits from British Gas Energy and Borgosh Energy for the duration of this energy crisis. They're really, really important. A responsible business looks after its customers, not just in the good times, but in the tough times as well.